What is going on guys? Gray here. Today I'd like to talk about orb generation and how the community is for the most part pretty upset with how Bungie went ahead and added the orb generation helmet mods into the game. Now when this was talked about in the TWAB several weeks ago, uh, a lot in the community or a lot of players in the community were really upset with this. They were hoping Bungie would change this idea before the Witch Queen was released, but sadly that's not the case. And in my opinion, I'm really enjoying the uh, Witch Queen as a whole. The DLC is absolutely phenomenal. And I will have a review probably end of the week or next week for the kind of Witch Queen as, you know, I get to play a little bit more. I want to get a lot of hours in before I give you, you give you guys my full opinion. But it seems like everybody's really enjoying it. But the big complaint, the one thing that I see people complaining about is the kind of orb generation helmet mods. Now, removing the ability to generate orbs via your weapon is a nerf in a lot of people's minds. You can no longer have two different energy types uh, and a kinetic weapon, you know, and generate orbs, you know, all at once. That's, that's one big issue. Also to use like, you know, a energy weapon. So if you used like an arc or solar uh, heavy weapon, you know, something like that, you need to sacrifice a lot more energy points in your helmet uh, to be able to create those orbs because that mod is not exactly cheap. No, it's not the most expensive, but it also is not that cheap. I'm not sure how big of an impact this is going to have down the road. Once we've got into the Witch Queen a little bit more, we get into our builds a little bit more. So I'm going to kind of hold back on saying it was a complete nerf and it was kind of useless to do what they have done. But the big, or really my big issue with it is master working weapons. I was thinking that they may look at master working we legendary weapons and kind of rework that. That's what I was hoping when I saw this in the TWAB several weeks ago. But right now, master working weapons is not really... It's almost kind of pointless in my mind in some ways. Now, yes, you're still going to get that stat boost. You're still going to get your kill trackers, that kind of thing. But you're not going to be able to create those orbs because you have to have a helmet mod in. So I'm not quite sure what the point of master working your weapon is unless they have a different plan later down the road. If they're going to change, uh, you know, legendary master work weapons some, at some other point. But like I said, as of right now, until I can get into the game or get builds going and things like that, I'm not really going to say that it's a huge change you know it is kind of a pain to have to use another mod but we're not quite sure exactly what the best builds are going to be so i'm going to kind of hold back on saying that it was an absolute nerf and it was kind of pointless to do my, like i said my biggest concern with it is why we still have master working of legendary weapons if they're not going to create orbs um it's kind of just pointless to me in a way anyway guys let me comment your thoughts and of course if you like the video hit the like if you have not subscribed yet please do so be sure to check out everything down in the description the community discord my twitter and of course the affiliates here on the channel empire jerky and amazon associates also check out the merch store that is linked in the description as well and i'll catch you all next time peace